If you ask me what it's like to be in the marsh, it is, it's magical and very difficult. I love it. I think it's a very special place. You always have some kind of wildlife next to you. If you're out there and the weather is beautiful, you can't help just to smile and take it all in. Hi, my name is Sarah Marshhauser. I'm the Senior Coordinator of Facilities and Habitats at Pine Island Audubon Sanctuary. Today we are going to go survey the marsh for secretive marsh birds. So we're going out on a boat and we will play callbacks. We have a recording for 10 minutes and the first five minutes is silence so that the birds hopefully forget that we arrived by boat. And then after that we play callbacks of each species. So we have king rails, the least bittern, Virginia rail, black rail, and common moorhen. <laughs> and if we get callbacks from those birds, we record it so that we can say if we have seen these birds within this season or not. They are called secretive marsh birds because they're very secretive. They hide in the grass, they blend in and camouflage very well. They make sounds that might also sound like frogs and insects and are hard to detect even by calls. If we see a bird that is, it's a big deal for us because we get very excited about seeing one. Um, we also know that means that they're using our habitat. These are species that are in steep decline. After doing a few of our restoration projects within the next couple years, we'll continue surveying and we will see if those projects were successful in increasing bird reproduction, especially of these secretive marsh birds. 